Hey everyone, today we're going to be working on the 12th problem of the introductory problems section of CSES, and that problem is palindrome reorder. So we're given a string and we're supposed to reorder the letters in such a way that it becomes a palindrome. So it's a 10 to the 6, which means long, long, and we're probably going to want an O of n solution. And if there's no string, print no solution, and we're just given the string. So, um, one of the most prominent ways that sticks out to me right away is the idea of putting all of these letters in a map and then at the end just splitting the string in half and putting one on each side. Say, put A in the front, then we put it in the back, etc. Or like all at once, you know, instead of putting them, like splitting them up, A and then an A, A. We just put these all in a map, and then we have a, just append it all at once to the front. So let's do that. Over here, we already have our directory and our file all open. I got rid of the normal standard in and standard out because uh, we don't need files. It's a small in. So let's begin. So we have a string that I'm going to call x, and then let's make a map of characters and strings and call that m and then when we uh get x and then for each of x uh and then uh we do m or if uh m dot count uh you know what we could just use a for R C in X and then um if M dot count C which is there if it exists um then M C plus equals X plus equals C and then otherwise um M or M C so now uh, we have the map created, and now it's just time to determine whether or not we can actually make a palindrome. And the way to see if we can make a palindrome, uh, well, we can do one of two things. If there is an odd number of, there can only be an odd number of characters in one of them. So let's take advantage of that. So for um uh x or auto uh actually it's just going to be let's do four because these are like kind of like pictures in the map so let's do four uh auto uh c c and m now this isn't a character it's more of a Error. I forgot how to define it, so we're just going to leave it as auto. And then we're going to do uh, if or string auto or odd. Oh, we're just not going to define it. Uh, let's define it as actually a blank string. So we can, like, what we're going to do is if odd. Uh, if c dot second dot length is odd, then uh, and let's say odd does not odd's already been set. Uh, does not equal that. Then we can see out no solution and be done. But if it's um if it does end up being mod two and nothing's been set to it before, or if it does end up being odd, then what we can do is just odd equals uh c second and then that makes it so that every other time we just have a string f 
first uh, steak. So now we just do per equals c dot sub or c dot second dot sub string zero to c dot second dot over two. Uh, and then wait. So if there's four things, then it'll be zero, one, two, three. Um, is this a of this? The string sub C plus plus. We're gonna look up documentation quick. Uh, it takes pause and length. Okay, so then yeah, we just want that, and then uh, or equals C dot second class plus equals. Wait, we want or equals. So in the beginning. We want everything to be prepended in the front. And then at last, we want everything to be appended. Uh, C dot. This entire. Because we only want half the letters. Uh, it doesn't matter. We don't need to worry about getting the second half because it's going to be the same. And then now at the end, we just print out fur plus uh, odd plus last. And then let's see if this worked. So let's build it and then. Uh, we get. Oh. We just have to switch around for and uh, I'm just going. We're just gonna switch around the character. So now, what we should do is test out. Uh, so let me let's just grab this. So it does become a palindrome, but what about when we have more than two Bs and it still works? And then what if there is this, but another A? No solution, because there's an, two odds. There's an odd number of Bs and an odd number of A. So I think we're good as long as we used LL instead of int everywhere, and we didn't even end up using int at all or any number types at all so uh let's uh just upload it remain.cpp and submit and we get an accepted so if you liked that video give it a like subscribe and if you have a better solution comment down below i may make a video on it see ya